Fa- well, he just negotiated everybody... 44 fences, that's didn't he, about knocking anybody over. says no. Anyway, that'll get you talking this morning. <laughs> Sky News Sunrise, John Nickel back at an hour. The website, skynews.com, aiming high. Why? Talks aimed at averting strike action by thousands of rail workers over jobs and working practices resumed today. Now a little something to lift your spirits. A man has become the first person to fly solo across the Arctic in a hot air balloon. And then they've got five years of government ahead of yes. them as well. Now it's only been one week of electioneering so far. How long has it felt to uh, you? Charlotte, we're Maybe about as good yeah. uh, as, as taking a pill to kill pain. Pe- some people get off on fondling cash. What? We're not talking about any form <laughs> oh, of fondling. Oh, I see. It's just we're money. Talking about the, we're talking about I the... I think that's um, a dangerous route to go down, to it be is, honest it with is. you. It is. It's, it's just the, the, the fondling that money gives you. Well, um, Twitter, we mentioned... I've got, I've got, how many have I got now? About 3,000, 3,500. It's not it's bad for somebody unknown. <laughs> <laughs> I do think it's, we could increase those. This could be good. Just good. At Sky would Charlotte you, follower. Would you really be interested? Perhaps just saying, when I see you riding the national using your mobile, is the next time you can drive with a mobile. Very good Thank idea. You. Or an unfriendly warning would have been fine. <laughs> I just think it's somehow, after a rundown of what else is happening news wise, Charlotte with those details. Eamon, thank you. And reports in the last few minutes that the real IRA has claimed responsibility for a bomb blast outside an army barracks near Belfast. Reluctant to sort of admit that maybe there is something. Exactly. Wrong. I think men can be quite bravado about these things. So. And here she is, the uh, the news editor of Heat magazine, uh, with the showbiz stories in the newspapers um, today. We've got a book on it, uh, so <laughs> to speak. Thank you very much indeed, Sarah Jane. Thank you, Charlotte. Um, thank you for watching this morning. We'll be back tomorrow morning to do it all again. It's the live desk next with Sarah Hughes.